Alright guys, so I am here at the thrift store to take a peek. Um, this thrift store, I was here not that long ago, but they actually closed down, um, I'd say like a week or so before Christmas, and they just reopened uh, back up today. So I want to see if they have anything new since the last time I was in here. Uh, last time I was here, um, I purchased that uh, vintage Bella doll for a dollar and I sold that so I, I like coming here and um just because I like small thrift stores the ones that aren't like you know all over the place just like locally owned type things and you know where the money is being funneled back into and all of that good stuff I like supporting those small um thrift shops so that's what we're doing today and yeah hopefully we find some stuff so stay tuned Look at these little frogs, they're so cute. Just the other day I was looking for a whisk that had rubber on it. Looks like they got St. Patrick's Day stuff out, Valentine's Day. Look at these little donuts. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Little keychains. Oh, they got necklaces too. I wonder if someone made those. I'm assuming anyway. What's this? Hand soap. What kind of cologne is this? Cypher. That's Bath and Body Works. Two dollars. I'm gonna get that. It's a shame I can't give it to my dad because that's what I do first. This is also Bath and Body Works. Aqua Marine Lotion. I'm gonna give that a sniff. It smells good. It's a really fresh, clean smell. Um, it's hard to say if it was used or not. I might look that one up. I don't know if I'm gonna get it though. As of now, I'm not gonna stick it in my cart. That's Tignanello. Kind of pretty. I always like taking a look in the little wallet section just to see. You never know what you'll find. Those are just like travel size stuff. More little travel size. Things. These are like makeup bags. Definitely don't need those. Because I have so many of them. What is this thing? Oh, it's a fan, but it has a spritzer on it too to cool you down. That's neat. There's not actually anything in there, it's just a case. They're all just kind of empty cases. Alright, see if we can find anything in here that we might want. Anything new that I didn't see last time I was here. Oh, this is a Bath and Body Works wallflower. Oh, they got ten dollars on that. That's, that's kind of kind of pricey there. A little pricey. <laughs> well, one, this little piggy's cute. But I was looking at this Humpty Dumpty sitting right here. What is this? Is that a teapot? What's that say? Fiat tax. It is a teapot. It's two dollars. 
that's really cute. I like Humpty Dumpty. A lot of people probably do, right? He's cute. I'm gonna stick him in here. I've also I'm gonna just keep that out so it doesn't fall. Anyway, I see like a mushroom sitting here. That's really cute. That would be cute sitting outside in like a garden area. I'm not gonna get it though. I don't think so. It's a little primitive pillow. Oh, look at this bee. Oh my gosh, it's on this like big spring. That is so cute. There's a lot of bee stuff. Oh my gosh, look at this. There's just so much cool stuff mixed in here. This is gonna fall. Look at that. That's so neat. I like him. I got two dollars on him. It looks newer though, right? It's not old. And he's missing like one of his feet. I'm gonna sit him back down. Okay. What else? What else? Anything? Some of those little wood. I got some of these cat's meow buildings, like a bunch of them at a sale. And I still haven't listed them yet. Still haven't listed them. These are the longer burger ones though. Makes me wonder if they're worth getting. I might look those up too. All right, let's take a look at the other side. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. <gasps> this looks like a newer Trapper Keeper though. Did they come out with, this is from 2013. Dango dango, I wish this were vintage, but it's not. I got all excited. I got all excited. I might look that up though, just to make sure. Puzzles. <coughs> All right, let's look at the toys. Last time I was here, I found a doll for a dollar and she sold very well. Maybe. <laughs> Dig down in here. A couple Barbies. Barbie dolls. The case. What's the full suitcase here? A folder. Going to grandma's. It's down in this bin. Little dog and a wig of some sort. It looks like a little pet shop playset maybe, but no. Little pet shop people. a backpack. That is adorable. I'm gonna throw him in my cart for a minute. There's something in here. I'm gonna see what's in here. Looks like a 
Barbie, or no, that's not Barbie. Bella, let's dance. It's like a DVD and a little play mat. Yeah, look that up too, actually. Just to make sure. Some dog clothes. And what's back here? Dora. Bella Dancerella. What is back here? Getting down on the floor here. What is this? <laughs> Seriously though, what is that? That's cute. I don't know if that's from like a movie or something. Monster Jam, Truckin' Pal. are all more like baby type toys. Floor tech. That looks like fun. Oh, this teapot's pretty. I wonder if it goes with these here. They're from Pure One. I know Pure One went out of business, so I don't know if maybe some of their stuff might be like getting harder to find type of thing. These are really pretty. Baja collection. Might look that up. I like that bowl. Let's take a look at those. Got some crock pots. The tray underneath, I don't know if you guys can see from here, but there's a big chip on that. I did see someone had like a set listed for like 40, but the tray has a chippy. Oh my gosh, look at this big champagne glass or martini glass. I don't know my, my drink glasses. I'm not a drinker, so I'm not sure. What is this? It seems out of place. Maybe it makes eggs. Excuse me. It's a little tight. It's a little tight in here. Got a little bit of a tight fit down here. Okay. These are pretty too. These seashell plates. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, goodness gracious, did you hear that? Did you hear it? Legs. I'm just gonna move this out of the way so I'm not it's really tight right here. I need to look at this guy. This is pretty. I like the color of it. It's from Kmart. That surprises me. Got two new wave ovens. All right, let's move down a little further here. I'm gonna back myself into a corner. Oops, I'm hitting a laundry basket. That's why I can't move any farther. I was like, why did I stop? a whole bunch of green if you like green my goodness it's like a whole set of storage dishes the shape of these are cool are these like the melamine i think they're called melamine they're from pure one too i don't really 
look at the books super often. These are all kids' books. Is anyone successful with selling kids' books? Or books in general? I like looking for just weird stuff. Like, what is this? Science fiction something or other. Like, that looks interesting. It's like a catalog of some sort. Previews of like comics or something maybe? I might look that up. You just never know. That's why it's just so important to look stuff up. Here's another one. So in case that might be worth getting, I'll have two of them. All right, so I looked them up and they're not really worth getting. And they're like $3 a piece anyway so I'm gonna say no to those it's so hard like it's nice that these are in like this organized kind of bin but it's kind of hard to open and shut it these are all glurs and I can barely open that one gloves in that too Okay. Woo! Tank tops and belts. I'm working my way over to the shoes and the purses. Normally that's where I start, but the music was bumping, so I started elsewhere. I wait till the fan comes on, so. What are these? Nicholas suspenders. Those look old. Okay, working our way. More books. I'd like to find some Stephen King books that are signed by him. <laughs> what are the odds? I'm sure some people have, have found such a thing, but I just don't really look at the books too much. I know there's a lot of people that do really well selling books, but it takes a lot of time to stand and scan, scan, scan. But then again, I stand and look, look up stuff, so not a whole lot of difference there. I just found these pretty sweet Adidas sneakers. I threw them in my car. Come upon the purses. So, I'm gonna take a look through them real quick. See if there's anything new. I spot a coach here, but I see a fake Louis Vuitton behind it. So let's see if it's real or not. It looks like it is. It's just very dirty inside. Nah, I don't know. I'm questioning that. I'm questioning that hard. I don't think that it is. It's a Tignanello. That there. That does not feel like quality. If you can't really like get to things, just touch them. You'll be able to tell what feels good. It will just pop right on out at you. This is kind of cool looking. Might try to get a better view of that. Is anything? And Rosetti. That almost looked like a coach bag, but it's chaps. Whoopsie. I think I knocked down a shoe. There's some shoes just like hanging. So I hang it up and I knock down the other one. Oh, welcome to my life. Welcome to my life. Sherpani. See, now this is unique looking. 
It feels nice. I'm gonna have to look that up just to make sure. I've never heard of it before, but it looks it looks nice. Oh look, and here's an Etienne, a small one. What do they want for that? Three dollars. What kind of condition are you in? Should we get that, you guys? I know some of you really like that. My mom loved those bags. There's a sack too back here. A yellow one. The zipper's kind of frayed on it. Oh, look, I see a coach. Oh, and a Michael Kors, too. How much do they got on their coach bag? What do they got on the coach bag? Yeah. It is 15. That's not bad. And they got 25 on the Michael Kors. I've never had a Michael Kors bag. I've never just, I don't know, never really been drawn to that brand. Dana Buckman and what's this? I'm not sure, but we're gonna look up this guy. Sure, Pony. All right, guys. So I am done. Um, in at the thrift store. I did end up. Uh, nope, those are my packages. My car is a mess. I did, I did end up finding two bags worth of goodies here today, and there's probably some stuff I should have picked up, but I didn't. But that's always the case when I'm out and about. I sometimes kick myself for not picking some stuff up, but you know, I I am under the the how I see things as far as like if it's there next time I'm here, it's there. If not, it wasn't meant to be kind of thing. So yeah, I'm, I'm really excited with what I found. It'll probably be in a separate video, my haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will see you next time.